Hi everyone, I'm Nate Clark and this morning I want to show you how easy and simple it is to replace your wired alarm system keypad with a modern home control panel tablet. This is the, the Fire 7 tablet, but a really affordable solution for a whole home control panel. So I'm using Action Tiles, which is actually just a web application. So Action Tiles can run in any browser. Um, in this case, I'm using a, a special kiosk mode browser called Fully Kiosk, which you can download from the App Store. But you could run it in Chrome or the built-in browser on the tablet. So this works on any type of touchscreen tablet or even an old cell phone. And again, you can reuse the wiring from your keypad to keep it charged and mounted onto the wall. Now what's great about Action Tiles is you can customize this any way that you want to. All of your smart things, connected devices, can show up as tiles. Here I've got Mine configured in the upper left corner where I can see the status of my doors. I can arm and disarm the system. Um, and then I've also added some buttons for lights here and I can control my sprinklers. And then my good night mode, which sets the alarm system and turns off all the lights. Now, Action Tiles is really easy to configure. You can just tap here and go to the builder and then you can add all kinds of different tiles and media. I usually like to do the, the building and the organizing on my, on my laptop computer and then because all of this is a web app, everything stays in sync. And now I'm going to show you how you can replace your old ancient alarm system keypad. It's actually really easy to do. It's only going to take you 10 minutes. Um, and all you need is, a, is, is one of these USB, uh, 12 volt USB to USB converters. Uh, I got this on Amazon for about $8. Um, and the wiring in your wall for your keypad is already suitable to power this USB charger so you can wall mount your tablet and have it powered all the time. Uh, I've already gone ahead and, and disconnected the power at the alarm panel. Um, what we're going to do is, because the connected device is powered by a 12 volt power adapter here, um, we can connect the wires for the keypad to the 12 volt output here. So I'm going to go ahead and pop off the cover of the keypad with the screwdriver. I've already unplugged this, but what you'll see in here is there's uh, a little wire harness with four wires coming out. Now, the, the red and black wire carry 12 volts power to power the keypad, and the green and the other pair of wires, in this case the green and yellow wire, are connected to your old alarm panel, and that's what provides the, the data signal for the keypad. Now, before you do any work here, make sure you disconnect the power. I've already done that. Um, and you'll want to identify those keypad wires in your alarm panel and disconnect them as well. So let's go ahead and just remove this whole thing off the wall. Great. Now I'm going to just use my wire strippers here to cut off this little harness so that we can reuse this wiring to power our charger. And I'm just going to cut these wires off and try not to let them fall into the wall. Okay, great. Now, we're only going to need to use one pair of these wires, um, the red and black for the power, and the green and yellow we can use for something else later. I've uh, stripped a little bit of the end of the wire here. I'm just going to twist it um, a little bit so that the, this is actually stranded wire so that the, the ends don't fray. This 12 volt to 5 volt USB adapter, now all we have to do is splice onto the ends of these wires, and we just simply match red to red and black to black. So for this, I like to use these are called crimp connectors, also called B connectors. And you just insert the two ends of the wires that you want to crimp together into the crimp connector. Push them all the way in. And then um, you can use a wire crimper or just simply a pair of pliers to crimp the connector down. It'll make a tight connection. Crimp that a few times. All right, and now we've got red to red. So now that we have our USB charger connected to our, our in-wall power, all that's left to do is mount the tablet and, and hook it up. For mounting, I really like these 3M command strips. It's basically just like heavy-duty Velcro that sticks onto the wall and sticks onto the back of your tablet here. It's really easy. It doesn't make any holes in your wall. Perfect if you're renting. And now all I just have to do is press the tablet into the command strips. And there we go. Now let's just plug in our USB charger and plug it into our in-wall power. All right, so I'm just going to apply a little bit of um, 
3M mounting tape to the back of this converter so I can mount it on the wall easily. And there we go. You've just converted your wired alarm system keypad to a whole home control panel. Uh, in this case, I'm using an Amazon Fire 7 tablet running action tiles. All the, the links to the products that I've used here will be on my website. That's connected.io. And please support this project so we can build more cool stuff, more products like this. And eventually I want to try to sell a DIY kit, something out of the box that you can do this yourself. So please back us today. Thank you so much.